And so uh, one day, Mike's talking to me, and he goes, that's that Lindsay girl. And I'm like, okay, who, who is that? And he's like, oh, I've always thought she's so hot. I always thought she's, she's so beautiful, but I've never really, you know, talked to her. She's, she's so amazing. And I was like, okay, so if any of you know me, what was the first thing I did? Walked right up to Lindsay and dragged her over to Michael, and they, they hit it off, and it was great. Oh, love. Get in my head. Set the world on fire. A couple days later, me and Lindsay are on a bus, and Lindsay will remember this, and Michael happened to not be there by fortune, fate, luck, whatever, I, I don't know what it was. And what does Lindsay say to me? She goes, oh, he, he, I've always wanted to talk to him, but he's just so hot. He's, oh, he's always just been like too hot. I don't know what to say to him, you know? But I'd like to propose to these two. These two are like family to me. They're like my brother and sister. I love them very, very much. And uh, they're just too hot for each other. So here's to my girl, Lindsay. Lindsay K, I'm in love with you more than you'll ever know. I'm sure you're getting your makeup on or already done. Just know that I couldn't be any, hap any happier on how I feel just getting married to you today. I cannot believe this day is finally here. You've come such a long way. I love you, you are my bride, and I am so jacked to marry you. All of my love, hubby, XOXO. Oh, I can't wait to actually kiss him. <laughs> For those of you who don't know me, I'm Lindsay's dad and Michael's worst nightmare. Um, when Michael first came and asked permission to marry you, my immediate response was, no way! realization that uh, the time had come where it was time for you to have a new number one man in your life and that was hard but quite frankly I couldn't find a better man to do the job than Michael. Oh, 
so pretty. You look so handsome. Mm -hmm. Beautiful princess. Thank you. It's gorgeous. <laughs> wow. I love it when you kiss me and again just because I am so over the moon excited to be your wife and I officially joined the Bomberito family. I love you more than you know you'll, you'll ever know and I cannot tell you how happy I am to be your wife. Thank you uh, for making me the happiest girl in the world. See you soon, my love. Forever yours, your bride. I told you that I loved you and I meant every word. You're the only man that I promise my heart and soul. And I will remember. You're so beautiful, baby. I love you so much. I can move home together <laughs> with that card. You're so let me look at you. <laughs> look at you. I love you. I know. I love you when you're near me. Make my heart skip a beat. All you do is touch me. You make my knees weak. I love you when you tell me all the things. I do I want to need. welcome Lindsay to the family. And obviously, when I when I obviously I heard Miss Mrs. Bomberito, wow. It was wow. Now do you know what Bomberito means in Italian? Good husband. Say it again. Good husband. What does it mean? Good husband. Yeah. You better live up to that good husband. Thank you very much for coming into our lives, Lindsay, Michael, and you'll do very fine, my young man. Love you very much. Very proud of you. Patient love that is kind will grow in love that's better with time. I will defend you, you will protect me, I will inspire, you'll be my fire, I will support you, you will uplift me, you can just be you, I'll be the real me, I'll be your best friend, you'll be my biggest fan, you are my favorite part of this place. When did your love start? And Michael's response is, I knew I was in love when we spent most of our choir trip in New York together. In New York, I realized that Lindsay had all the aspects I wanted in a partner. And Lindsay's response is, I knew I was in love with Michael the moment he picked me up in front of the Bethesda Fountain in New York City to take our first picture. I wish I could show it to you. He put me down on the ground and we went on to spend the rest of the day together, living up our last moments of New York City and then flirted relentlessly on the way back to Minnesota. I knew right then and there I wasn't ready to let this man out of my life. Michael was and still is the answer to my prayers. I still look like a baby? No. No? But you are still my baby. I love you so much. I love you too. You light me up. You set the sun. You bring the crowd. came to me and asked me to be her maid of honor, of course, I was more than thrilled to celebrate this amazing day with the two of them. 
just they both become like my best friends and I've never seen Lindsay happier than she, when she is with Michael. All my life I've waited for this moment Lindsay, I love you. You are my best friend, my beautiful bride. I am so excited that our days Oh, right now? Are you kidding? Jeez. I knew from my uh, first semester at Iowa State that I didn't like being away from you and I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. I am so honored to become your husband today and I will strive to give you the best of myself knowing what precious gift God has given us. You are the spring you are the fall My big debut my I promise to keep call. myself open to you and to let you and my innermost fears and feelings, secrets and dreams. You were my dream crush in high school. I called you Superman behind your back because I thought you looked like Clark Kent. <laughs> Never in a million years did I think I would be standing before you today making promises that would mold the foundation for our new life together. I get to spend the rest of my life with Superman. All my life I've waited for this moment now In your eyes Finally I know The life and love we shared for the last four and a half years have made me so happy. Only having you as my wife could make me happier and more complete. There's nothing I'd rather do than be here now with you. This moment. More than anything, I promise to love you forever, with all my heart, with all that I am now, and all I am yet to be. Words cannot express how excited I am to become Mrs. Bomberito and to finally call you my husband. I take you to be my wife, knowing that my love for you will never falter and only grow stronger with each day, each day we share. I will be honest and your faithful husband, always and forever. I can't wait to live out the promises we make to each other today and for the rest of our lives. I love you and I will never let go of you, Michael Joseph. I now pronounce you husband and wife, and Michael, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>